Jaguar's hopes for a major increase in North American sales no longer rest as heavily on the appeal of its XJ flagship sedan, nor do its high-performance credentials depend solely on the 550-horsepower XJR model tested here. While the XJ was for a time the closest thing Jaguar had to a volume model, it's now just the largest and most expensive of three sedans the brand currently offers, one rung above the midsize XF and two steps above the new entry-level Shea. The real quest for more sales rests in the latter end, especially, in the also new F-Base crossover, at the same time. The XJ's role as the Mark Summit leader has been at least partly usurped by the F-Type sports car. That's all for the good, considering that Jaguar's expectation, when it introduced this generation of its XJ in 2013, that it would expand its market share in the premium luxury sedan segment has come to naught so far. Actually, after a one-year surge to more than 5,400 sales in 2013, Jaguar found fewer than 3,700 XJ buyers in 2015. Gaining traction in this arena has been complicated by the arrival of fresh iterations of the segment's biggest guns, the Audi A8, BMW 7 Series, and Mercedes-Benz S-Class. <laughs>